Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's Chance Parks. And Joker Carmine. Otherwise known as Christian Galarza, we're here in a match of radiation demolition on Call of Duty Black Ops. Yeah, this is a really good game. We weren't expecting this, considering it's radiation. We both kind of hate the map. The map sucks, dick. But, um... We were yeah. actually really surprised with the uh, outcome of the game. I don't know what we're doing. Are we fast-forwarding or are we just gonna play it like this? You should probably fast-forward it and reduce the time. Okay. Well, here, it's this is my perspective right now. We'll get to Chris's later. Hopefully, I'll make my own account and uh, show my perspective. So, I mean, uh... Chance Parks could make our own uh, YouTube channel together. Yes, our Machinima account. Uh, speaking hopefully, of Machinima... Hopefully you make it into Machinima. Uh, what I'm basically... I sent the guys an email on the respawn team for Machinima, and I'm hoping for a reply that's saying, oh, yes, we'll allow you to do videos for Machinima. I'm really looking forward to doing it if I do get in, and hopefully I'll be able to do uh, like partner commentaries with uh, Chris over here. So it'll be kind of fun. Just As you can see, I died right there. But, you know, honestly, I wasn't expecting much from this game at first. Yes. We all, we, like, during like, the first few rounds, literally, it was just me, regular, spawn camping, being a douchebag and doing our normal stuff. See that beastiness right there? It's horrible. I don't really know if it's much of a big thing, but we were actually uh, having a debate whether or not we could not cuss during the actual gameplay. And we did surprisingly well considering none of us cussed. We acted like true gentlemen, though we kept dying sometimes. Especially me. It was horrible. Chris was trying like not to die from cussing, like non-cussing the whole time. He was freaking like almost crying. Yeah, it was it was pretty bad, but you know. That is Chance Park's bag. It sucks. It was a good match. I don't know about you, but spawn camping is A-OK -okay on my list. And there's the last kill right there with a ballistic knife that got me like 4,000 XP. Final blade. Um, Technically it was 25,000, wasn't it? 2,500. Alright, 100. If it was 25,000, that'd be so epic. It's more than you get for like getting a thousand kills with a Galil or something like that. Well, I prefer not to use an ACOG scope with the Galil, but... You know, it's okay. It's. I, 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 one game I had to pick the gun up and I could not use it, but I guess it works for chance. It's a sexy beast. I prefer a Galil extended mag and uh, sleight of hand. Uh, sleight of hand is nasty, man. It's all about Warlord Pro with their two tomahawks or whatever Semtex frag things. As you can see here, they all spawned in that one area. I got my SR and freaking got knifed from behind because the guy had to follow me to get a kill. But that's okay because I've turned myself around pretty soon. This ended up being probably one of the better matches, especially on these next two rounds. I don't know. It's a pretty good game. I mean, one advice for future or potential spawn campers. I mean, yeah, an attack is pretty much a necessity. Another thing, just don't be stupid. Be smart. I mean, you don't want to go out there guns of blazing and expect like a, like six all six kills. You gotta be uh, resourceful and tactful. Yes, like me here, shooting out 30 bolts into one guy, picking up random guns. It's a horrible idea. Take out motion sensors with your gun. I'm just gonna put that out there. Don't take out motion sensors with your guns, or don't take out anything. I mean, if it's a final, like if you can't get close to it because you know the guy's inside, then yeah, you got no choice. But you, you're better off flash or concussion inside the building. Don't flash or concussion. Wait if you have to. Yeah. It's, it's, you have to. This is the better round for between me and Chris here. Uh, yeah, this, is, this is our favorite round. This is the best round. Uh, I think right now, currently, I am 44 and 17. With, and it was, Chris is... I have no idea. Let me check. Uh, well, he's uh, 57. I'm, I'm 57. 28. Uh, yeah, I think this is the first game I ever got a legit uh, SR-71, considering I, I only play on the weekends, but I was actually pretty surprised. I play most of the time, but like, I'll probably most of the time. Like, I'll get my dog ready all the way down. As you can see here, basically what I did was get a bunch of kills, get my chopper gun and attack dogs, and once I got those attack dogs, and I was trying to put my chopper gun in like six times. And my skewer. Um, got a bunch of kills right here. I died. I tried to put my chopper gunner in. Yeah, I know for a fact we're gonna have like 
commenters saying, oh, spawn camping is gay and stuff. But honestly, I don't care. I mean, the, the main thing about playing is you should have fun. I mean, yeah, the people you're, getting, you're killing is not going to have fun, but it's actually really quite interesting. It's quite interesting to see what they say after the game, too. Yeah, it really is. This is sad right here because I went full like a, almost a full minute without getting a kill or dying it was really stressful like i was like what the hell i think is going it would on? be for anyone just like oh my god <laughs> all right so it's gonna take me a second here and i'm gonna go ahead and jump to chris chris's point of view and i gotta say chris is pretty beasty in this this game right here i think that's the best i've ever done uh, considering i only went 25 and one for my last game So, here's Chris with his Galil with an extended mag. Oh, uh, if you're wondering, I was using an ACOG and suppression on my Galil, and he's using an, only an extended mag. I prefer not suppression on my Galil. I think it's just, I like the sound of the how the Galil uh, shoots. But, I don't know, it's actually all, it's all up to you. It's all personal preference. I don't really like using an ACOG or any sort of um, sight on my Galil because it, it actually is, has a fairly well placed... Uh, Iron sight. I like it a lot. See, with extended mag, I, I could you could see you could just spray for like a full minute, and you would guarantee the kill. And that is if there's a person there, obviously. And mind you, throughout this entire thing, I was not cussing, though I wanted to a lot, and it was painful. But I won the bet, though. I guess you get an electric guitar. Spy plane ready for deployment. But yeah. Counter spy plane up, they're But this game was by far the funnest I've ever Our played in a while. In it was very different playing without a cussing spree, I guess you could call it. <laughs> yeah, throughout this entire thing I was like, oh my, I have died. Like I was so robotic, I couldn't even play any emotion because I knew if I did I would cuss. You mother! Oh, yeah, he's the closest he ever got to cussing in this game. I think it was on. Uh, we had to be on a Crisis, and he said. Uh, oh yeah, I was like, you mother! F and then I stopped there. I knew if I put any more emotion, I would end up cussing, and I would lose the bet. What the? F okay, Chris, it's okay. Don't cuss. Don't lose the bet just because you freaking have to cuss one time. Yeah, that's the thing. Always be careful with grenades. It depends what you use, but if you use black jacket. Yes, yeah, because I always say flank jacket. I, I don't know. <laughs> flank jacket. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't really care too much, but if you're gonna use, uh, it depends what you use. But grenades are incredibly annoying. As you can see, I went really, uh, I did really well, and then I saw that I realized that we were supposed to be defending. And yeah, I was, I was almost at my dogs actually. I needed two more kills. It was so. I, that was the point where I almost cussed. It was so sad. I was like, <laughs> I think it was next round. He, uh, he was down by the, uh, I think it was, it's B, no, it's A, uh, underground, where he was, it he was, was so down sad. by the bomb site and he blows up because he doesn't realize that the bomb is like armed and it's the enemy calling, like it's the enemy's turn to plant. I was so focused on like this game. It was so intense. Yeah, that was my first so. SR. Yeah, I couldn't place it because chances was on. Uh, yeah, it was like a bunch. Of, like we had a constant SR this whole game. It was just constant. Yeah, I, there was actually throughout the entire game. I didn't. I think there was one time we maybe didn't have it for like a minute. Right? Probably around that. Like no more than a minute. <laughs> well, I don't know. It was. Uh, I was doing a, a mirror's edge thing right there. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I saw a guy on the radar. I was just like, oh, oh. Oh, yeah, I remember this place. I remember playing a game and I just like totally raped so many people just standing there. Me chance out of the right idea. Oh, I realized I had like three spy planes, so I, pl I placed them in right before the round ended. It was like friendly spy plane inbound, friendly spy plane inbound, friendly spy plane above, and I was like, Chris, calm down on the spy planes, man. Yeah, this is when I realized I forgot about the fourth Look at this beast right here, dude. He goes completely beast mode. He almost like he's like three yeah, kills off from dogs. Yeah, and, then boom. and kaboom! blows up on me and I was so <laughs> mad I was like oh but it's it happens I, I didn't realize that it was our bomb site and had I actually defused it I think I would have gotten my dogs yeah if you had actually go with you I'd be able to defuse it without time and yeah you would have got your dogs 
Yeah, I realize I am camping and spawn camping, but uh, 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 anyways, you know, it, it's just, it's a game. Some people take it too seriously. Did you plant your tack at all? Actually, I gave up with my tack. I gave up putting my tack down. I was, you know, I was like, I don't care. You should put it by mine. My tack never gets destroyed, and if it does, it's on summit, and they, like, find it, like, really, really, like, it takes, it's difficult to find my... Tactical insertion because I place it so well, as you saw in the back of that spawn. Well, that's pretty much it, you guys. This is coming to the ending of the game, sadly, and uh, that's pretty much it for our commentary. I do have to give props though to um, uh, what's his name? Shadow is the dark. I mean, he went 106 and 32, and I could, I'm pretty sure we watched his video. He didn't. He didn't really spawn. Uh, spawn camp like us. He did really well. So yeah, props to. Uh, Shadow is the dark, going 106 and 34, and props to Chance and me, 85, 22, 76, 37, which of course, is... I did better and got 50 more points than he... I that is because you. of your dogs <laughs> and your chopper gunner, <laughs> so, yeah. Good enough to get mine. It was just shut the... Anyways, <laughs> so that is uh, our commentary. I hope you enjoyed it. If you are pissed off, I could care less, <laughs> but I do appreciate comments and uh, subscribe to Chance's channel. Alright, see you guys later. Bye.